Fluorescent lamps contain mercury and regulations may require that you recycle them at end of life. Due to the fragile nature of most lamp types, care and guidance is required to remain in compliance with DOT shipping requirements when preparing spent lamps for recycling. Lamps should be packaged in containers that protect them from being broken during storage and shipment. Acceptable types of containers include fiber drums, the original cardboard boxes from the manufacturer, and cardboard lamp boxes with or without liners. If you're reusing boxes from the lamp manufacturer, ensure that any openings or seams on the box are taped and sealed prior to being used. Otherwise, begin by assembling your box by folding and taping all edges and seams on the bottom of the box. Carefully place lamps into the box using packaging material such as newspaper to fill any extra space in the box to prevent breakage. Do not break or crush lamps before placing them in the box. Do not include any waste materials that are not lamps. When the box is full and properly packaged, close the top flaps and tape the box ends and all seams to secure the box for shipment. Make sure all lamps are fully inside the box. Transporters will not accept shipments with lamps exposed or protruding from the packaging. An inventory of lamps should be taped to the outside of each box or written on the box. Each box used for containing lamps should be clearly labeled with universal waste lamps. An accumulation start date should also be included. The accumulation start date is the beginning date the lamps were stored for disposal. Shipments of large quantity lamps should be palletized. Boxes must be placed on a pallet by stacking evenly across the full width of the pallet. Do not allow boxes to overhang the edge of the pallet. Stack boxes no higher than 48 inches and do not crisscross the stacking of boxes. Secure the boxes to the pallet using stretch wrap. Remember to wrap the pallet as well to minimize shifting of the boxes during transit. Prior to pickup, lamps should be stored indoors and protected from the weather. Wet or damaged packages may be refused or may be subjected to additional handling fees. Contact your customer service representative to schedule a pickup or delivery of material to the nearest Veolia Recycling Facility. Once at the facility, the waste is processed appropriately and a certificate of recycling will be available for your records.